seven nodes is all it takes to make this. Add a plane in the viewport, go to geometry nodes and start by deleting the group input. Now add a cube node and an instance on points node, then connect them to the output. Give the cube node some more vertices and increase its size a little. Add a cube in the viewport and give it a bevel modifier, give it a few more segments and shade it smooth, then move it somewhere and forget about it. Drag the cube from the outliner into the geometry node setup and plug the geometry into your instance. Now add a color ramp here, connect it to the scale and add a noise texture into the factor with these settings. Change the colors from pure black and white to something a little closer together. Try to make sure the cubes don't overlap. Move the pins closer in. Duplicate your plane in the viewport. Right click to drop it. Then hit this button to duplicate your geometry node setup. In this second node tree, delete the color ramp and noise texture. Change the scale and size to make the inside of the cube. Now we're going to make it loop. Go to Edit, Preferences, Animation and change this to Linear. Exit Preferences. Select your outer cube and change the noise texture to 4D and duplicate it. Then mix the two textures with a mix color node. On frame zero, change the W value of the first noise texture and the mix factor to zero. Hover over the values and press I to add a keyframe. Change the second W value to negative five. Now go to the end of your animation and do the opposite. First texture to five, mix factor to one, and second texture to zero. Hit play. It loops. It's calming. Enjoy.